Master. Little James. May I have a moment? Of course. I am. Um... Forgive me, I'm uh, not always confident to speak. Slow to speak. It's a very good quality. <laughs> I wanted to ask you a question. Please. So you are sending us out with the ability to heal the sick and lame. Yes, that, that is what you said. Yes. So you're telling me that I have the ability to heal. <laughs> Forgive me, I just find that difficult to imagine with my condition which you haven't healed. No, it's the same as all day. One thing that is annoying me, though, is these people, they are believing in him and, and praising him, and don't get me wrong, that's great, but it's because he's healing them, the Samaritans. Yeah, that's pretty much what he said. That's all they needed. I know. I just don't know how many of them would believe in him if he wasn't healing them. So I have to ask. So then why... I mean... Why hasn't he healed you? How do you watch all these healings today? Does it bother you? Fair questions. Uh, I'm still trying to figure out how I feel about all of this. I, I mean, I suppose one big thing is that I haven't asked. Why not? I don't know. If I had your uh, struggle and I was watching what was happening today, I demanded. I don't know if I should. It just doesn't feel right. You know, and I suppose I've, I've just been grateful that he called me to follow him in spite of it, but it's never come up, not even once. I'm just afraid that if I mention it to him, it will make him change his mind about me or something. Do you want to be healed? Yes, of course, if, if that's possible. I think you've seen enough to know it's possible. Because I trust you. What? Little James. Precious little James. I need you to listen to me very carefully. Because what I'm going to say defines your whole life to this point and will define the rest of your life. Do you understand? In the Father's will, I could heal you, right now. And you'd have a good story to tell, yes? Yes, that you do miracles. And that's a good story. But there are already dozens who can tell that story. And there will be hundreds more, even thousands. But think of the story that you have, especially in this journey to come, if I don't heal you. Praise God in spite of this. To know how to focus on all that matters, so much more than the body. To show people that you can be patient with your suffering here on earth because you know you'll spend eternity with no suffering. Not everyone can understand that. How many people do you think the Father and I trust this with? So much more. So much more what? I don't know. Stronger? Better at this? James, I love you. But I don't want to hear that ever again. I know how easy it is to say the Song of David that I fearfully and wonderfully made. 
but it doesn't make this any easier. And in this group, it doesn't make me feel like any less of a burden. A burden? First of all, it is far easier to deal with your slow walking than it is to deal with Simon's temper. <laughs> Trust me. Are you fast? Do you look impressive when you walk? Maybe not. But these are things the father doesn't care about. You are going to do more for me than most people ever dream. So many people need healing in order to believe in me. Or they need healing because their hearts are so sick. That doesn't apply to you. And many are healed or not healed because the Father in Heaven has a plan for them which may be a mystery. And we remember what Job said. The Lord gives and the Lord takes away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. When you pass from this earth and you meet your Father in heaven, where Isaiah promises you will leap like a deer, your reward will be great. So hold on a little longer. And when you discover yourself finding true strength because of your weakness, and when you do great things in my name, in spite of this, the impact will last for generations. Do you understand? Thank you, Master. A man like you, healing others. <laughs> Oh, what a sight. I can't wait to hear your stories when you return. Shalom, my son. Shalom. And James. Remember. You will be healed. It's only a matter of time.